You know that creating a recent blender can be challenging. I'll show you the new kit UV Sims, which will help you with this work. Let's have a look at it. To install the kit, you need to go to Edit, Preferences, Add-ons, Install, and install it from your desktop. Enable it. The default hotkey is Alt Spacebar, but if you want to change it, you can type UV name and here so you can change this hotkey. It's very easy to start work with UV Sims kit. You need to select your object, be in edit mode, enable showing UVs. The next step is to hit the hotkey. Default is on spacebar, other themes, and again unwrap. So and everything is unwrapped. But for example, we have some difficult places here, so we need additional cuts. And for example, I would like to remove this one. So mark scene, clear scene, and unwrap again. And now everything is perfect and was done in a couple of clicks. Let's improve this experience because you can mark islands not only by edges but also by face selected areas. Let's check it. Unwrap and now we can see this big area here. But what if you want to edit it separately from other parts? It's possible. You need to have polygon or edge selected, then select the island and isolate switch and then you can edit this model or this part of model separately when everything is ready you can switch back uh, edge or polygon should be selected to have this pi menu active switch back and now everything is ready the next important option is uh, smooth with hard edges. You need to hit it a couple of times. And for example, now if we select this part and hit and wrap, we can see that hard edges were select, uh, adjusted automatically, which is really good scene for baking normal maps, for example. Also, you have an interesting possibility which allows you to lock some UV islands from editing. For example, if you want to separate ready parts from not ready parts, or if your model is too complicated. So, to do it, uh, you need to select face or edge of UV island. Then you need to hit pin UV island. And now it's pinned. If you hit unwrap, this island won't be here anymore. Let's check it one more time. Pin the island. So you can notice that they have different colors. And they are not available for editing here. So to edit them again, so we need to select polygon or edge of this island. Unpin and then unwrap. And you can see that this island is here. So if somebody is interested, all these pinned islands, they are here so above the main uv square so just don't forget to unpin it before packing your uvs it was an overview of uv sims kit which i am using in my day-to-day -day work so it's available on my game road page also i'd recommend you to use it with uv Packmaster and text tools add-ons to cover all you need in uv editing thanks for watching